Hi everyone, welcome back to the Linux Lighthouse, your guide to OpenSUSE Linux. Today we are diving into the world of OpenSUSE, one of the most versatile Linux distributions out there. OpenSUSE offers multiple flavors to suit different needs. In this video, we will explore OpenSUSE's main two OS types, Leap and Tumbleweed, and take a look at their existing derivatives like MicroOS, Leap, Micro, Aeon, Kalpa, and slow roll. Let's get started. OpenSUSE has two main operating systems. One, Tumbleweed, a rolling release. Constantly updated, always provides the latest software, ideal for those who want cutting edge technology. Security module, app armor. The second one is Leap, a regular release. Follows a predictable release cycle. Minor releases every 12 months. Major releases every 36 to 48 months. Offers up to 18 months of support for each release. Built on the stability of SUSE Linux Enterprise Server. Security module applied App Armor. The next major release of Leap will be version 16, based on SUSE Linux Enterprise 16. So, Leap is perfect if you want a stable enterprise-grade Linux experience. Let's take a look at the existing derivatives of OpenSUSE. Number one, Leap Micro combines Leap's stability with the security features of MicroOS, and it released twice a year. Recently, I tried to download Leap Micro and to give it a try, and unfortunately, I, it I was not successful to be able to install it. It continued to give me some kind of error that is not able to boot. So maybe it's a bug in the image. Uh, I still don't know. And I will update you once I get uh, around this uh, issue. Second one, slow roll. An experimental spin of Tumbleweed. Updated every 30 days. A balance between stability and speed. The security module applied is App Armor. The third one, Micro OS, designed for servers and desktops, provides a secure and stable system, follows the same release cycle as Tumbleweed. The security module applied is SE Linux. Number four, Aeon Desktop, based on Micro OS, a read only system using Genome Desktop. Keeps your system stable and secure with Tumbleweed updates. The security module applied is SE Linux. 5. Kalpa Desktop or Kalpa. Also based on Micro OS, focuses on delivering a premium KDE Plasma experience, a read only system with the latest updates from Tumbleweed. The security module applied is SE Linux. It should be perfect for lazy developers who no longer want to mess around with their desktop and just get stuff done, especially if they develop around containers. And this applied on Kalpa and Ion desktop. It should also appeal to the same audience now more used to an iOS, Chromebook or Android-like experience where the OS is static, automated and reliable and the apps are the main thing the user cares about. This means that you can use Kalpa, Eon, the same way like you are, you are using your Android phone or uh, iPhone, iOS, and you only care about the apps. You don't think too much about the operating system updates. Once it's released, you just apply it, you hit install, and that's it. And just keep in mind that Kalpa and Eon is not designed for people who like to tinkering their system. Like for an example, I try to install uh, Tor and Tor sockets on uh, on my micro OS uh, desktop, uh, Kalpa in particular. And I was not able to start the Tor service and using it. Not the same way on OpenSUSE Leap or Tumbleweed. So keep that in mind. Now let's check this OpenSUSE tree on the top is OpenSUSE. 
This tree structure makes it easy to see how OpenSUSE caters to different user needs from stability lovers to cutting edge enthusiasts. As you can see, we have two main branches, our leap and tumbleweed, and from these two branches, leap gives us leap micro, tumbleweed gives us micro OS, and from micro OS, we get Eon and Kalpa. Tumbleweed also leads to slow roll. So from tumbleweed, we have slow roll and micro OS, and you can consider Kalpa and Eon as just a different name for KDE and Genome. If you want to use micro OS with a GUI, you go with Eon. If you want micro OS with a KDE Plasma desktop, you go with Kalpa. You want Tumbleweed, but a little bit slower, 30 days update, I mean the release cycle, you go with Slow Roll. OpenSUSE has something for everyone. If you are a developer or like the latest software, go for Tumbleweed. For a stable and reliable system, Leap is your best bet. For a specialized needs, try Leap Micro, Micro OS, Eon or Kalpa. OpenSUSE's flexibility and innovation make it one of the best Linux distribution out there. I hope this overview of OpenSUSE and its derivatives help you find the perfect version for your needs. Don't forget to like, subscribe and comment below to share which OpenSUSE version you are excited to try. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video.